When I tell you I have the most amazing wife, you better believe me at my words. I have the most amazing wife. Do you want to know why? Because she takes liquid iron and smells amazing because of it. That might be one reason, but the reason I was thinking of was she thought to pack my knee pillow. I literally can't sleep without this and I forgot to put it in the packing pile? What the heck? I'm so grateful for Ellie. She is the packing queen. She is. How is it? How's the taste? You can't feel me, I'll just swear. Oh no, we can't have enough of that, right? I kind of love it. I honestly kind of do. Having your wife have a sailor's mouth is kind of cute and adorable. Okay, we are just about to take off on our Christmas vacation. Oh my gosh, guys. I am so excited to go see family. We're so excited that we tried to come a day early. We have a bag full of medicine. Vitamins, medication, vitamin C, iron, everything I need to survive. Ellie just got injections in her neck and we'll play those clips right now. One hour later. I can't even close my eye, it's numb. <laughs> now that I can finally blink with both eyeballs, I have a bag for the dogs. They each got a new toy for the car ride. Ah! Um, Jared's like, should we get the kids a book? I'm like, no! <laughs> <laughs> but we're definitely getting dog toys and dog treats for the dogs because why not? We have a 12 days of Christ myths that we are bringing up north with us. We have, oh! we have my water. Mm -hmm. I am sweating profusely in this onesie, but I know as soon as I sit down in the car, I'm gonna feel great. The car is packed to the brim. Two minutes ago, I was like, you know, this, I literally said out loud, I said, this is miserable. We're literally packing everything. We're still gonna have to go to Walmart and get snowsuits for the kids. Because they've outgrown everything we own. But we literally <laughs> packed every, like we packed our house, to just go live in another house. It's gonna be worth it, the memories, the family time, the quality, it's worth it, but it's hard work. It is. We are packed, the dogs are ready, we have their kennel somewhere, we have a blanket if they just wanna lay down. Hopefully we have leashes Yep, accessible. everything is right here. Yes. Oh no, actually I put the leashes right here. Good, because convenience when we for, for potty breaks and everything. Oh, good gravy. Okay, bathroom and then let's go. Christmas booyah! All right, doggy doggies. Are you ready to rock and roll? Let's go get in the car. <laughs> She's excited. Let's go. <laughs> Do you like your little spot? And your chalk toys? I picked that out just for you, my pretty girl. I picked it out for you. I have one for you too. Cover's like, um, where's my toy? Well, they're so excited. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Look at his little bed. He's like, that's more like it. <laughs> See? No, hop down. I know it's small. We're in tight quarters right now. I'm really glad we got the Max. <laughs> yeah, me too. Her cushions are stopping the door from closing. Okay, watch your little toenails. Oh, jeez. Ready? Yep. There we go. Woo! Goodbye, kids. <laughs> I'm gonna take a nap. We're just pulling out of the driveway. I wanna share with you the snacks I packed. Um, we have a bag of grapes. Yummo. We have a bag of mandarin oranges. We have some popcorn and beef jerky, some water, and after a while into the trip, each kid can have a little treat. I think so that's pretty fun. good. That's not too shabby for a road trip. We're trying to certainly kind of be good. I mean, it's gonna be a week of probably just eating out a lot, but. It's certainly better than the previous road trips we have taken. We're making conscious decisions. <laughs> I'm trying, I'm starting to, I'm at the point of my pregnancy where I'm swelling, so. Did you say smelling or swelling? Probably both. <laughs> you know I do take liquid iron. Um, and that's all, okay, anyway. Um, on the road, here we go. Okay, last thing about this road trip is I did pack the kids' iPads. However, <laughs> I'm not just giving it to them. Um, they, I'm so proud of them. They, I just love that they love books. I love that they love books. 
like I never did as a kid and I'm so glad that they do. But I also have a bag that just has regular paper and colored pencils. So we're gonna do books, we're gonna do colored pencils, we'll sit and be bored for a little bit, look out the window, and then towards the tail end of the trip when it's kind of getting like, we're kind of cranky, um, I'll pull those out and we can like watch a movie. So I'm loving this. We're gonna run and fill up with gas and we don't have to fill up with gas very much. We usually only fill up twice a month because, if that. yeah, if that, um, because we usually try and just drive our Tesla around town. I'm so glad we got that when we did. I've, I've really enjoyed having an electric car. It's interesting. People, I feel like it's like a love or they hate it. I just think it's really nice to have one of each. So you have a gas car and electric car for around town, those types of things. And the tech has always been one of my favorite things, but having both, you get the best of both worlds. Goodbye, good weather. Hello, snowy weather. You can literally see the two differences. Heading north. Woohoo! We are going from one point of Utah. From the bottom to the top, now we're here. <laughs> and that is why Copper is sitting in the front. He is just resting on Ellie's leg. Like, what the heck? <laughs> What did you find? Oh, you ate it! Gross! It wasn't yellow, was it? Oh, good. What? An icicle on the car. Do you know what we get to do right now? This. Woo! First snowball in a while. Gotcha! <laughs> Alright, let's go get back in the car. You having fun in the snow? We're gonna have a lot of fun at Grandma and Grandpa's house. Okay, let's go get in the car. It's cold. Jared, if I sneeze, I'm probably gonna go to the bathroom. I really need to go, I've needed to go. But we're trying to just get to one exit first, so. We almost there? Um, no. <laughs> we might need to, oh, okay. It's another 20 minutes, Jared. Should I try and find a different place? I would try and okay. find, now that we we're past Salt accidents. Lake. Yeah, just no rush, but move over. It's been, kind of just snowing. We are excited to get there and eat. This has been one of the most enjoyable car rides. The kids have been the so good. The kids have been so good. I rested for a minute. They've read, they've laughed, they've played, I don't know what games they've played back there. Uh, they're laughing. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> we haven't gotten any electronics out. We don't plan on it now. At this point, it's been a really good ride. It's been so good. So Lots I've been Christmas waiting music. for a specific exit because it's going to be so good for the dogs to be able to stretch and go to the bathroom. Oh. But I think there's another one. I don't think we've passed it already, but it's closer. Okay. Not as ideal, but it should work. Okay. I mean, any gas station's yeah, great for a dog. They can fun. run around, yeah, but um, <laughs> at this point, I, I'm, I'm more worried about my comfort than the dogs. <laughs> Tommy! <laughs> he couldn't wait two seconds. Should we go see Grandma and Grandpa? Hi, Penny. You excited? Hello! Hello! Oh, Penny, off, off, off! <laughs> She's excited! Hello! We made it! Do you love them? Oh, yeah! Hello, 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 hello. Hi, Mom. Oh, hi, oh how are you? good. Better now. Oh, <laughs> hi, Dad. Oh, 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 good to see you guys. Thanks for taking your shoes off, guys. Oh, oh. you're the good buddy. Oh, you're the good dog.
He's a good dog, Ben. You have well, to use the whisk to rub away the clumps. We'll get it. We leave you out for two minutes and you come in with clumps of snow all over the place. He doesn't like it. <laughs> and I don't like him for it. Ellie's panicking for Copper. No! Is he cold? We don't have a whisk. We'll get a whisk. A whisk? Oh, the places you end a vlog when you don't want to wake anybody up in the family. We found a whisk, so Copper is now snow free, but it is Definitely crazy how it just attracts to him and sticks onto him like little snowballs. It's so funny. But we are so excited to be here with my parents and family. My dad has a little concert tomorrow, so we're so excited to see him perform in that. But we made the trip from the very bottom of Utah to the very top of Utah, and now it is time for us to go to bed. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.